Hello, hello, hello. How is everyone? And here comes Fufu Cuddly Poops. Come here, baby. Come say hello real quick. You need a beer. Oh, I know it's bright, isn't it, precious? I know. Oh, it's so bright. I know you're squinting. It's okay, baby. Yeah. Say hello. Say hello, Fufu Cuddly Poo. Yeah, I was snoozing, so I have bed head, so I look adorable. Yeah. So cute. Mm. This is my precious baby. I love her so, so much. Yeah, this is Poo Cuddly Poop. Yeah. She's such a sweetie. She's such a good girl. She's my um, emotional support animal as well, and yeah, she actually tunes into my emotions when I'm having like anxiety attacks and ah uh, bad shit like that. But it is what it is. Um, yeah, I wanted to do the giveaway drawing. Sorry, I'm not feeling the greatest actually. Um, about a week out for my period. PMS, my version of PMS. I actually get like fever chills. And, um, yeah, my whole body kind of just takes a shit. <laughs> but, um, here, let me put her down. But, yeah, so, it, and it's actually cold outside because there's a storm. And that kind of sucks because with, uh, paired with the fever chills, I'm, like, extra cold. And it's not that cold <laughs> right now. But, yeah, so that kind of sucks. But I wanted to make sure I came on. And at least said hello to you guys and I could do the drawing for the signed print giveaway um, that we had in my story a few days ago yeah I think it was Monday Monday and today is Wednesday so it's a couple days ago so for everybody who missed out I am so 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 sorry thank you for everybody who did the bonus entry share I really really appreciate it and yeah Let's do this. So I have everybody's name in here. Oh, shoot. Let's shake it up. Shake it up really good. Or really well. For all you grammar police out there. So we're going to shake it up really, really well. Oh, shit. And there goes another one. And back in. And let's see who the winner is. Drum roll, please. I'll close my eyes. And got one. Let's see. Let's see who it is. Hopefully, it's one I can pronounce. Yeah, it starts. <laughs> Not sure how well I'm going to be pro be able to pronounce this. Hello, hello, everybody who just came in. Um, the winner is Axelios, and I think I'm pronouncing that right. Otherwise, can you guys see that? Maybe, kind of. And of course, I wrote in cursive, so you probably really can't read that. But yeah, I will put a little uh, story together and let you know that you won and I will get in contact with you so you can send me your address and I can get that in the mail as soon as possible congratulations and thank you so much for everyone who participated I really 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 appreciate it and yeah um, I wasn't sure when I'd be doing this live otherwise I would have posted what time I was gonna be on but yeah like I said I'm not I'm just not I'm not at 100% and yeah, it sucks to get the flu like pretty much every single month, yeah, pretty much every single month. The fever chills really um, get me and that's actually, I don't always realize when I'm going to get these chills. That's actually why I have so many goosebumps from my Punisher um, photo shoot. So if you look real close at the Punisher shoot. Yeah, it was cold, like, don't get me wrong, but I ski and shit, so I'm like, I'm pretty good with the cold, but yeah, no, when I get these fever chills, I, I just can't help it, but I have so many goosebumps, like, all over my legs and everything for the Punisher shoot, but, um, yeah, um, once again, the winner is, let's try to say this again, 
Eggs, Elios. Eggs, Elios. Congratulations, congratulations. Um, yeah. I'm so happy that a handful of you are here. Hello, hello. I'm so happy, Don. Always a pleasure. I hope you're doing very well. We've got uh, Den Jeff here. There was Mike Roche. Your Black Hero is here. Yeah, that's wonderful. I'm so happy. Like, I'm happy. I'm just like, I get exhausted. I get so tired. And it's very interesting when you have insomnia and you're like dog shit tired, but you're just awake. You're just really awake and when I say I'm dog shit tired once I finally do get to sleep um yeah I can go 18 hours no problem like I also have chronic fatigue syndrome so yeah I'm I'm a boatload of fun so I've actually been a lot less active than I wanted to be um with cosplaying because my garden is literally destroying my time and the weather is not cooperating in the slightest I have not all of the things back in the house today but quite a bit like I have at least my tomatoes and my peppers back in because I don't want them to die. And then I have some, I did plan out one of the beds that's all finished and yeah, I had to go and put garbage bags over that and I, yeah, I, I think I, did I have this robe on? I probably had this robe on. No, I had my Maleficent hoodie on. And yeah, I looked very special outside. I'm sure the neighbors enjoyed, enjoyed that view. Um, but yeah, everything seemed to have survived the night, and yeah, if it survived last night, it should be fine today, and then I think this shit will be over, and maybe I can get some of the warm weather crops out, but yeah. I am doing very well, um, outside of just not feeling the greatest, but this is, this is every month, so it is what it is, you know what I do? I, I just, I deal with it, <laughs> you know? I, you deal with it, it is what it is, and... Like I said, I hope one day I will be here telling you that the endometriosis doesn't affect me anymore. It's completely gone. All of the growths and all that shit is gone. But, you know, we'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get there. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. You guys help me so much. So, so, so much. So much. You guys help me. Um... Because this can this this can be very depressing. Ooh, we're not gonna cry right now. Um Yeah, chronic illness can do a lot to your mind. But otherwise I'm you know, I'm good. I'm good. And I love you guys so much. So 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 much. Yeah. Oh I got hearts here too. I'm doing well. How are you, Jacob? Oh, I got more hurts. Yeah. But yeah, I like literally just washed my hair yesterday, so it's in that in-between phase. I'm just tired. I'm rambling. So yeah, I'm I'm probably. What are these? I don't know what all of it. The... See, they put like new shit in here, and I'm still trying to figure out a lot of old shit, but. Let's see if this does anything. Oh, okay. So it tells you a proper question and like filters them in. Gotcha. Ha <laughs> Um, how tall am I? I am almost five eight. I am five foot seven and a half, and I feel like if I got my back cracked properly, I might be that five eight. <laughs> um, so I'm kind of tall for a girl. Um. I guess. I don't know. I'm taller than the average woman, but I'm not, I don't think I'm like super tall, but what is super tall anyway? I think every height and everything in between is beautiful. Be perfectly honest. Oh, good to hear your voice. Oh, that's so sweet. I wish I could hear your voice. One day we'll, we'll have like some massive group chat or um, at a convention. That would be amazing. I really want to figure out how to like I don't know do like Thanksgiving dinner at a convention or something um a panel or like teach you guys how to garden and grow your own food um I know a lot of stuff I can I mean I'm a chef I, I cook I can cook almost anything um I'm 
actually a really good chef. But ironically, I don't toot my own horn about a lot of things, but I'm really good at cooking. I can't cook rice worth a damn. And I can cook risotto, but I can't cook plain rice on the stove top. The rice cooker is the best invention ever fucking made. Like, seriously, if you've never used one, you are missing out. You have, um, it takes you too long to make rice. There's too much effort in, ma in you making rice, but yeah. Um, yeah, I can't make rice. I have no idea why. It's a weird one. Um, I can literally make anything else. There's like maybe one or two other things that I literally just can't make for the life of me, but rice is, rice is the one that people normally look at me and are you fucking crazy? Um, my best friend literally said that to me. She's like, are you fucking crazy? I'm like, no, just, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get going. I'm so excited for our winner, Exelios, and I will get that in the mail very, very, very soon. And I'm actually gonna do a bonus. Um, not gonna draw another name, but I did notice that somebody who has, well, there are a few people that have sent me things before were entered the contest and they've sent things to my P.O. box, so now I have your address, so now I can do whatever I want with it. So, if you've ever sent me anything, a uh, greeting card, a uh, gift, um, stickers, whatever it is, um, a drawing, whatever it is, I may just send you a signed print Maybe a little gift here and there when I feel like it. Why? Because I fucking love you guys and you guys are so supportive and you guys never have to send me anything ever, ever, ever. I love sending you guys stuff though. So yeah. Um, yeah. So I, in the next like week or so, um, Foo Foo Cuddly Poops, mind your manners, and you use your indoor voice. She actually does know the difference, so don't don't yell at me like, this fucking dog doesn't know what a damn indoor voice is. Yes, she does. Um, but um, yeah, if you've ever sent me anything, you could be in for a special surprise in about a week. So keep your eyes peeled on your mailbox, and yeah, I'm, ex I'm excited for that, and I hope you... Um, I, I love surprising people. It really, it, it brings so much joy to my heart. And yeah. And you guys are actually making me feel a little better. Um, speaking of which, I did not get it yet because I do not check my P.O. box all the time because I get things in frequently. And I likely checked it probably like just the day before that your stuff came. And yeah. So I am going to go to my P.O. box very, very, very soon and obviously mail out um, these prints and I will double check my P.O. box then and I will let you know as soon as I do but yeah if I was to check my P.O. box every week that yeah it, it's just not happening it's just not happening I go about once a month unless somebody tells me that they sent something and then I'll and then I'll like make an effort to actually go out and check it but otherwise I check it about once a month um, will you be at Heroes? What is Heroes? I don't know what Heroes is. Damn, I really do feel like shit. Like, I'm off. I'm, like, I'm good, but I'm off. But, yeah, no, I, I, I do think it's important to, like, come on here and, yeah, hang out with you guys regardless. I'm actually, um, oh, Heroes Con probably not I'm not exactly sure where that is if it's in Colorado there's a slight chance <laughs> but um yeah being broke is a lifestyle adulting is a thing getting making sure your bills are paid sucks um because there's like four movies that I want to see but I had to prioritize freaking Endgame Charlotte North Carolina I have actually never even been to Charlotte or North Carolina in general um, but I would love to travel 
Um, I will travel anywhere in this world. So if you guys ever want me to potentially be a guest cosplayer in your local area, because I'm in Colorado, please, please, please write into your convention and tell them you want more cheese. Or more cheese, please. Use your manners. You get more things with manners. Trust me. But the, then some people don't give a fuck. They're just assholes. They're not real human beings. <laughs> Watch out for them. Let's see. Do a YouTube series for cosplay. Um, I do have, I mean, anything in particular as far as, like, doing a, um, like, do you want cosplay whips or damn i am so off i am so sorry my concentration is fucked i hate this and i wish i could blame it on the pot but it's really not it um yeah if you want like whip stuff but i do some behind the scenes stuff i normally i normally don't um record the whip stuff i don't really have a good reason why either um i probably could do some time lapse stuff um, of course I'd be interested in being a guest. Oh my god. Yeah. I love- I want to travel. I want to come see you guys. Ooh, we have hair up here doing things. Yes. Give it to me. Give me alfalfa realness, bitches. Lovin'. Yes. Anybody else remember the Little Rascals? I don't remember the original series, but when they did that remake with Whoopi Goldberg and- I don't know the children, but they were freaking adorable. It was a cute little movie. Let's see. It's like an interview type series where I'd ask you, oh, you're talking about doing that. Gotcha. There we go. I told you guys I wasn't feeling good. I feel so bad right now. I feel bad, not like physically, but I feel bad that I can't express myself the way I normally would and give you the energy that I normally would. Uh, we're not going to cry once again. And that's also the PMS. Like, I feel like my hormones are a little, a little extra. And I cry a lot, mind you, but I can normally tell when it's like me, um, psychic shit, like spirits, um, somebody else's emotions or, um, hormones. So, yeah, this is hormones. This is definitely hormones, and dude. I would love to be a guest on your show. Absolutely. Oh, my God. Abs I'm flattered you even asked me. Little old me, cheesy me. Melts my cheesy heart. Oh, my God, absolutely. Um, DM me um, after this. Just... DM me after this, and I apologize if I don't get right back to you. Like I said, I feel like shit right now, and I'm like, I'm gonna go, um, I'm just gonna go sit down. I'm, yeah. But, yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, DM me after this, and I will get back to you as soon as possible. But, yeah, I'm gonna go sit down, because I really am feeling like hell. Um... But I love all of you guys, and I know I already said I was going to sit down like five times, but I love all of you guys, and oh, so nice to meet you, Walter. My name's Elise. Danger Alley, if you know. But, um, oh, I love the hearts. I love hearts. But, um, yeah, I am going to go sit down. Um, any of you guys that are actually concerned, I am okay. I promise you, I am okay. But... I love you guys so, so much. Mm! Yes. All the love. I'm going to give you guys a big hug right now. Mm. Mm!